we used to go in her ballroom and stuff like that on New Year's and stuff like that, man. And we'd be, we could chill in the ballroom, you know, the hood, the hood spot, you know what I'm saying? We stayed right next door, so you hear the music bumping all night long. You dig what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, Birdman, uh, Sugar Slim, it's a lot of them, man. Lack, uh, Killer Star, you ever fuck with, uh, you ever fuck with Master P now? I ain't really, I ain't really knew P like that. I, I seen P a couple of times. I spoke to him a couple of times. Um, when he was uh before he blew up, before No Limit blew up, yeah, he used to be out there at the uh, second lines and the DJ selling his uh music, you know, out the trunk, man. He had a white uh Astro van, man. Yeah. He had the ice cream man on the side of it. <laughs> so he, yeah, yeah, bro. Shit. He, yeah, yeah, yeah. He used to have the hat to the back, you know what I'm talking about, with the right, uh, right. You know, with the little, little glasses on Cartier's or whatever. You know, he just be coming through selling his music and stuff like that. But uh, I ain't really really mess with him like that. C Murder was real cool. Me and C Murder chopped it up. Yeah, before. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah I, they showed C. Up. They showed C being more in the in the in, in the, the street. In, they showed him more being because, like you say, if you from New Orleans and how, like you say, you grow around, it's more like a family environment. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it is. You know.